Hello. So we are going to do an airsoft cytology. I've already gotten my sample from the pets. So here's our two little ear swabs. One is cut in half to signify that it is our left ear and this one will be all right. So as I'm preparing it, we don't want to necessarily rub it, but just lightly roll the swab to get as much sample as we can. And then do the same for the other side. Okay. Then always label your slides on which side is which. So in this case, left is on the top and right is on the bottom. And we'll also have the patient's name as well and their signalment. So once we have our slide prepared, we'll put it on the microscope and get ourselves um, focused on the lowest focus, which is our 10, and then slowly move up until you eventually get to oil. Just want to make sure you have it focused on all fields. Focus, 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 focus. And then we'll go on oil, but before we go on oil, we'll put a little tiny drop of immersion oil. If you don't, practice members get very upset. And then we have to replace the lens, which is not very costly. And there we go. And then here we're going to do our skin scrape. I have a scalpel and I have lubricated it up with oil immersion. I'm going to lightly scrape the skin. I'm going to lacerate it slightly, that way we get some sample onto the scalpel blade. Once the uh, skin is collected, we'll go ahead and place it on our microscope slide where we'll view it for microscopic yes. evaluation. Uh, can this switch around? Hello? Hello? Question mark? That's Hello? Fine. It was Bala that did it. Hello. And it just got some blood. It's me. Can't, but go ahead and switch around button uh, disappeared. There is our skin impression stain slide. There is a squamous cell right there in the middle. Um, it's a little bit clear, so it's hard to see. And then the rest is just gunk. Oh, I'm sorry, baby girl. Okay, ready? For our vaginal cytology, we were unable to find a speculum that was small enough for this dog. Going to talk about so we used a, um, an air swab coated with saline for lubrication and we simply just inserted it into the vagina to get some sample and then our next video will explain how to view it under the microscope. Movement and her being uncomfortable. So you'll take one of the cotton tipped applicators and apply the sample like so. Similar to how you would apply um, an ear swab cytology, 
Just lightly roll and not smoosh it all together. I like to do three different lines for three different viewpoints just to make sure we don't miss anything. Once that's done, label all your slide with your patient's name and specimen of what you're viewing. So our patient. And then vaginal cytology. Once we have that labeled, we'll go ahead and state it. So same principle as we do with our ear swab cytology and our skin impressions. We'll do 10 seconds of the blue. And we'll do 10, or sorry, 15 seconds of our red fixative. Make sure to blot any excess stain, just to not contaminate.